excited right now to get into some of the details that you've heard about earlier in the presentation. Right in front of me, I have a great example of what visionary mobility looks like. For us in the U.S., we wanted to stand, just start off with such a high level of equipment. And right now, I'm going to dig into those details and show you what the details, what the important things are from a technology standpoint and also from a packaging standpoint, what we were able to do with the UWI. So first and foremost, we're in the front of the vehicle on the standard US profile, we will have the adaptive LED headlights. I know there's some questions about it. Is it an option? Is it standard? No. In North America, it is standard, adaptive LED. Very perfect for the positioning of the vehicle. It has a unique U-shaped headlight daytime running light, which has a, a nice uh, character that's going to cross over entirely along the entire BWI products. Next thing that to notice is we have this really innovative wheel package all across the BWI 3s. One thing for sure is we picked a lightweight aluminum forged wheel that has such an amazing turning radius. It's 32.3 feet, and what this really enables us to do is perfectly match the car's agility and functionality in a city environment. So, 32.3 is just a number, but in essence, what this does visually is that you can really make a U-turn with this car that's like nothing else out there. Because the powertrain is down below with the drive cycle, the drive uh, module, we were able to free up and have these extreme turning radiuses. Also, what's, what's really nice about this package, other than being efficient, is that there's really good wheel travel as well. So, no issues with bumps, we're good to go. As I go here to the side, I want to talk a little bit about the drive module in the vehicle. It's completely integrated into the car. Life module on top of the carbon fiber. And of course, we have the thermoplastics. Extremely safe. The use of carbon fiber, super light, super strong. We say it's approximately 2,700 pounds. And what that does for the transformation of the vehicle is that it has the 50-50 weight distribution that makes this car the ultimate driving machine. As I swing a little bit here to the quarter the rear, as we swing the vehicle a little bit. I want to highlight some of the, the interesting things as well with the lighting effect. We have these floating LED taillights. Again, this U-shaped taillight design, LED, part of the BMW i character. Now, if we stop right here, the e-drive motor, electronics, everything is here in the, the left rear. Very compact, rear-wheel drive BMW. For the i3 with the range extender, the range extender is going to be located in the right side of the rear. But what this allows us is to have a seamless, integrated, floor pan that's the same between the i3 battery electric version and the i3 with the range extender. So there's no bumps, there's no intrusions into the interior space. You have the same type of luggage capacity in the rear, whether you get the i3 with the range extender or you get the battery version. Next I'm going to swing around here and show you this right rear corner. What's really innovative for us is the charging. In the U.S., we equip the standard i3 with a 7.4 kilowatt onboard charger. So, what does that mean? Well, actually, that means that we can charge a car from 0% to 100% in approximately three hours. So, for the people who know active EVs, we we're in the four to five hour range. We have a 32 kilowatt battery. Here, we have a 22 kilowatt battery and it's still the 7.4 kilowatts AC fast charging. For the optional DC fast charging, which is the SAP combo connector, uh, that's gonna allow charging from zero to 80% in 20 minutes. So, what does that mean? We're delivering really a quick experience from a DC fast charging standpoint. 
Now I want to talk a little bit about the coach doors. Uh, I think some of you guys have already seen him playing around with it. It's really neat because when you open the front door, we left to show the carbon fiber visually because you can stop it right here. For us, it's a matter of authenticity, right? We're proud of the carbon fiber that we use in this vehicle. And we left this panel here, right in the middle of the vehicle, to show, hey, this is CFRP. This is the first mass production CFRP vehicle. And we're, we're really proud of that. So from a design, design aspect, very beautiful. Coach doors, again, carbon fiber, allowing us not to have the B pillar. Phenomenal entry into the rear. Seats are very thin. Also, very functional. This interior package in here, also with the messaging of BMWi, very sustainable. This has a sustainable cloth and the leather combination in the US vehicle. Uh, this interior will be in the Giga. For the most part, also you can see the eucalyptus wood, renewable, very locally sourced to the production facilities that we use. We also have this renewable very sustainable material, it's called Kinef. We have it all over the dash, the door panels. This is this new technology, this new design topic of being next premium. Focusing on being sustainable, this new modern design. Another thing, of course, is, you know, we talk about screen flow and what that does from a driving standpoint. Great visibility from the driving seat. But also, when you're in the back seat of the vehicle, great visibility from the rear. The feeling is, it just feels that much better to have this open feeling. This vehicle has the, the uh, large screen that we have that we're offering for our navigation professional. Uh, connected drive and all of its benefits, the range fighter, also being able to change driving modes and actually have this interaction between the driver and the vehicle to say, hey, I put this navigation point B. The way you're driving, the way your state of charge is, maybe I'm going to recommend to you that you switch to Eco Pro mode or Eco Pro Plus. This is that type of level of intelligence that we have integrated with the BMW i3. Of course, I encourage you guys to come and see the car, play with the slide through experience, this is, uh, this is really part of the concept. Living in a city, very useful. The vehicle itself, extremely light, fast, and agile. True to the BMW Ultimate driving machine, and has the DNA in it, and the innovation is laid out in a very simplistic design, very modern. So, thank you guys.